If you are confused about the difference between the hyphen, the n dash, or the m dash, or how to make these symbols in Microsoft Word, then this video is for you. If you found this video, then you are probably at least aware that there are different kinds of dashes, the hyphen, the n dash, and the m dash. Visually, they are different in length only, but they each mean something different and unique in punctuating a sentence. The hyphen is used to join or compound words like 21, state of the art, or eye to eye. The slightly longer n dash means to or through and is used to separate years, dates, or scores, ranges of numbers typically. I most often see this mistake on resumes where hyphens are used instead of the proper n dash. And finally, the longest dash, the M dash, is the one that takes the place of commas, parentheses, or colons. Or it can even indicate missing portions of a word, making it quite a versatile little punctuation mark. N dashes traditionally are less formal than other punctuation marks, but are more intrusive visually. So if you want a portion or section of text to really stand out, N dashes can do that for you. So how do we create these dashes in Microsoft Word? Well, there are several ways to create hyphens, n dashes, and m dashes. I'll give you the three most practical ways. The first way is from your ribbon. Just go to your Insert tab, click on Symbol, More Symbols. That will bring up your grandmaster list of all special symbols that you can insert into Word. Next to Subset, if you choose the category General Punctuation, you should see a collection of dashes from which to choose. The first one is the hyphen. Clicking on the next few dashes, you'll see the name of the dash below, along with other information such as the character code and shortcut key. We'll talk about that more in a moment. To insert any of these dashes, simply select the dash you want, click Insert, and Word will insert that symbol wherever your insertion point was located in your document. Now that's one method. Another way to insert dashes is to use special character codes plus Alt-X. If you remember, in that symbol window, each dash had its own special code. Typing that code out and then typing Alt-X will convert that code to that special symbol. But perhaps a simpler way is to use Word's keyboard shortcuts. By default, pressing Control plus the hyphen or minus key will create an N dash in Word. Similarly, pressing Control plus Alt plus the hyphen key will create the M dash in Word. I should note that if these keyboard shortcuts are difficult for you to type or to remember, you can change them to anything you like by pressing the shortcut button in the symbol window and then typing out a new keyboard shortcut right from this window. Or alternatively, if your keyboard has a number pad, you can use the number pad shortcuts. Alt 0150 will create an N dash, and Alt 0151 will create the M dash. And that's three or four basic methods for creating dashes in Word. There are other ways, though. If you know of another method, show off what you know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.